Greetings all you Manic Minds on Crimes, and welcome back to yet another installment of Manic Mondays. Man, it's been a very long time since I said that. Simply because upload schedule didn't line up with Monday for a video every three days or something like that, and I didn't really have much to talk about, but this channel has reached a thousand subscribers, and thank you all so much. It's been kind of a journey. Uh, yeah, a bit of a journey, it's ups and downs, all that stuff, but I just cannot thank you guys enough, and, you know, road to 10k, hopefully. So, with all that being said, what really is this Manic Mondays about, other than thank you, thanking you guys from the bottom of my heart for me helping this channel reach 1,000 subscribers? Well... There are quite a few things now that I am going to be doing. First off, I'm going to be getting Biomutant, hopefully, very soon. This is a game I've wanted for a very long time. I've talked about it. Um, I know a lot of the general consensus of it is it's like mediocre and um, people people were just overhyped for it and it wasn't ex they weren't you know they were expecting more but they didn't get as much as they were expecting. I don't care, Motor Brother has it, looks fun, and that's all I really care about. I mean, story, yeah, that's important and all of that, but if the game is fun, the game is fun. Like, do I care about the Payday 2 story? Not really. Is the game fun? Oh yes it is. Even though it is one of the glitchiest games I have ever come across, only beaten by Fallout New Vegas. Anyway, with all that being said. The other game that I really want to get is Tunic. This is another game that has been on my radar for a little while now. I didn't know about it bef uh, as long as Biomutant because Biomutant had so much press behind it. Tunic didn't really, but it's slowly getting more and more uh, people playing it and getting more and more popular. Um, and that's not the reason why I want to play it. It's It just looks like a fun game. It's like a Zelda-ish Dark Souls-ish, isotropic, um, you know, top-down perspective. Uh, that's what that term is, isotropic. Um, you know, game, and it, it just looks fun to me. And I've seen gameplay of it, and I'm like, damn, this really is up my alley. So, Biomutant and Tunic are eventually going to be coming on the channel. For both, I'm probably going to be doing long plays that have very little editing. Uh, simply because they're... Biomutant especially because it's an open world unless there's like a long stretch of nothing but anyway other than that what else am I going to be doing on the channel well eventually this is eventually I have no idea when because I have writer's block like you wouldn't believe I am going to be doing my own uh, original stories on this channel a story where I write everything and read it for the channel I've wanted to do this for a while, but I was never in the right mindset. I couldn't really think of anything. I have a few ideas floating around in my head, and I've just had such bad writer's block uh, that I just can't really write anything. And I've been writing for quite a while, so this is something that is eventually going to happen. Eventually. Um, and if it turns out that it actually never happens, then it never happens. But I hope my writer's block doesn't, you know, absolutely destroy this for me because, again, writer's block, bad. I have really horrible writer's block, which sucks so much. And if you've never experienced writer's block, it's like you know what you want to write, but you can't write it. You just, you, it's, it's almost like it's physically impossible for you to write it. It's just, it's bad. Um, anything else uh, going on the channel? Well, I'm going to be doing more Payday 2 stuff uh, because I've just been enjoying the game too much. I'm going to be playing Black Squad on the pay on the channel again. Um, I don't know if I'll get back to the Halo Infinite campaign because my computer absolutely despises it, and I cannot look at that low frame rate uh, while playing and also while editing because that that background that footage is just uh, my computer just barely runs Halo Infinite as is, so I would really need to upgrade my computer, but I just can't, because that would be expensive, and I just can't. I just don't have the means to. 
So there's going to be more payday, like I said. Uh, there's going to be uh, Black Squad again, because again, I've been playing it again, enjoying it again. There's a new season, uh, new things. Black Squad is still a very fun game. Never played it. If you've never played it, try it. It's free to play. It's... It's basically CSGO, but better and not as sweaty. There's still sweat lords, and there's still, of course, cheaters, but they're few and far between. It's really more of an arcade -y sort of shooter. If you've, if you've watched the game or played it, you understand. It's just a fun game. It's a game I really do enjoy. Um, as for Warframe, I know a lot of people are thinking, Yo, where the hell's Warframe content? Is there anything in the game for me to talk about? Not really. I'm kind of tired of doing uh, weapon reviews. I'm kind of tired of talking about frames. Because at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter how you build your frames or weapons for the star chart, for normal missions, and even arbitrations. It kind of doesn't matter. Because you're so overpowered that the enemies can't do anything. I mean, what's the difference between a Nezha build with no mods and an Umbral Nezha? Nothing. Pretty much nothing. Uh, you're going to be invincible in the star chart either way, so there, there really is no difference. Same thing with Oberon or any other slightly pretty tanky frames. And I just have not been playing the game. I've been playing other games. And speaking of other games, Superland. Uh, I will continue with it, but even though everyone, uh, the, the poll that I, that I put on the channel, like, hey, you guys want more Superland, and people mostly voted yes, I'll get to that eventually. Um, right now, I really just, I really just want to play Payday 2, and Black Squad, and that's just, that's just kind of how I am. If you've watched the channel for any length of time, you know that when I, when I'm in the mood to play a game, that's basically all I'll play. Um, I don't force myself to play other games, and I, of course, if you're new to this channel, hello, I don't play popular games. I don't play games that you know would get me thousands of views like some people were wondering hey you've got Dark Souls content why play why not playing Elden Ring I've explained this in videos before one Elden Ring doesn't interest me at all I'm done with Dark Souls until unless Bloodborne comes to PC then I'm doing a full series on that with DLC for sure and secondly my PC simply cannot run Elden Ring it, it can't I don't even have the minimum requirements so, yeah, and I'm sure as hell not getting it on the Xbox because one, I lost a few cables from my Xbox One, and two, I don't want to play my Xbox One much anymore. <laughs> uh, so, anyway, with all that being said, again, thank you guys so much for getting this channel to a thousand subscribers, and I'm really appreciative of the people that have stuck around, um... With, with me on this um, I don't even know if this is a journey or anything. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this channel is just <laughs> me uploading whatever the heck I want but Legitimately, thank you Thank you. It's kind of crazy You know a thousand subscribers and that's like a small number really right, but imagine a thousand of anything It's quite a lot quite a lot so, anyway, that's basically what's going to be coming down the pipeline of uh, this YouTube channel. I'm eventually going to, I'm going to have, hopefully soon, Biomutant. Um, uh, eventually, I'm going to have Tunic, because that's another game I really want. I've already explained that. And eventually, if I can actually get over my writer's block, which I think I might, I think I'm on the cusp of, I'm going to have original stories, and I might might very slight might do my own Dragon Ball what ifs like other YouTube channels like Smug Stick and Salad Saiyan but I don't know I'm, I I have ideas for them but at the same time I don't know if you guys would like that because you know I barely talk about anime on this I mean I have two videos on Dragon Ball Heroes and that's it um, but it is a possibility but original stories yeah, that is something eventually I will do. Hopefully I will do. Unless my writer's block fucks me over again. But, yeah. Uh, so, with all that being said, again, 
thank you guys so much for sticking around for supporting me even though i don't get a lot of comments anymore which kind of sucks and um you know just 1000 of you 1000 maniacs that is quite quite a lot of people and yes that's what i call my fans if you're new the maniacs because you'd have to be crazy to like my channel Anyway, that's all I really had to say for this episode of Manic Mondays. First one in a year or two. <laughs> Been a very long time. But, um, yeah. I have a few things coming down the pipeline. So, we shall see where the road takes us from here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and remember, in Troby, we trust.